Greetings, Cosmos, and welcome back to, uh, Ed Labyrinth. Alright, we finished Hall A and start on Hall B. I think we did this one and this one, and now we're on to this one. Exciting explosion by Shin Bison Cough. I better make sure that I did, in fact, do... Yeah. So this one's not a short one. It's a real level with some difficulty to it. Oh my. I'm not sure what to make of this. Uh oh. Nitro. Okay. What's this do? Okay. Wait. No. That was my fault entirely. I thought those were gonna stop at some point. Okay, and then I would just want to... Okay, so... What? I didn't bounce. The first time I didn't bounce, I thought that was because I had uh, landed at exactly the right spot to uh, not do that. And now I'm seeing that sometimes that just happens. Uh -huh. Okay, these enemies are barely an issue. Weird. Oh, oh no. Two, one. I didn't jump soon enough. Okay. Not sure what to do about that formation. Wish I either had more hits or... Oh no, I wish I had both more hits and... Uh... What's that other thing that I want? Checkpoints! The enemy positioning in this game is kind of weird in that it seems like it barely matters. Like, the enemies are not the thing that's going to get you. Okay. So. I want to get over here. Yes. Oh, no. Okay, so that's how I'm going to get through here. Okay, I was very lucky with that because the way I handled that was not good. Okay, so I need to ascend, I guess? Oh no. Oh no. Okay. So then I want to head up on this one, and then go on to this one. Oops, I think I jumped too soon. Okay, so let's... Oh good. The explosion was stopped somehow. 
And now it's over. Alright, that was a really interesting use of those mechanics. It's done more with uh, explosions than I've ever seen. Rule one of the lab. More explosions. Assistant, write that down. More explosions. Using the snake blocks as a solid platform at the end was explosively clever. Explosions can indeed be exciting. No, please, don't let them manifest as this TNT-shaped menace. It really is. A little bit tight platform was. Interesting use of obstacles. Not a very janky mechanic. I could see this used in an actual episode. Poor indication at the end. Unpredictable and quirky at times, but very enjoyable and creative. Snake blocks are very funky. Alright, let's try another one. Jumping Koopa Cruise by Ness Wednesday. Oh, it's a short one, supposedly. With low difficulty. Supposedly. Oh. Look at this lighting. An extra life. Okay. Hey, player man, could you help us? On deck three, some jerk decided to cork up all the showers. Our maintenance crew is trying their best, but they can't reach the corks. If you could help give them a boost, that would be great. Please? We don't want anyone's vacation ruined over our short hoppings. Okay, so what's that sign mean? No jumping for Mario? Or not? Or no jumping into certain things? Okay, so this tutorial shows that enemies will jump over shells. Oh, hey. And that's how I'm supposed to get over this. Oh, no. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Pianist guy. Okay, checkpoint. Okay, so... Okay. So you can't kick these around. Whoops. Huh. How do I get that enemy to hop even higher? Oh, I know. Oh, I can't bounce off of these. There we go. Whoops. Eh. There we go. I had to just get a little bit of a running start. Oh, hey, you. Tell me things. Oh, you're just jumping. Gotta keep going. If I want to become the strongest Koopa on Earth. If I had waited longer, or if I hadn't waited as long, that would have been fine. Okay, nice. Okay, you can't accidentally kill yourself with these shells. There we go. Alright. Science!
Okay, is there any reason to have this Koopa hit all these things or... Red have a blue overalls. Do you know that way back in my day, all we wore were masks with the face of a man? They look just like you. All right, the clogs. We have several workers in the changing room who jump too low to reach the corks. Without shells, they can't go anywhere. Help them out, will you? Everything has to be in tip-top shape by noon so we can start sailing a few hours later. Okay, so... Oh, I'm gonna have a heck of a time jumping here. need to hey thanks for the help don't worry about the flood we always drain it off before sailing how about a fancy star for your effort it's all yours dear red I do like this level that's an interesting gimmick I guess you disabled the interaction between Koopas and the shells I wish I could party every day like this, but work calls. Lady Boss has been coming in and going home early. Suspicion. Out partying. This cruise ship has some of the best elevator service. Now I need to look for the food. Quite charming for jumping Koopas. Steps are diverse and can be a vanilla con submission. Peacefully goofy and cute. Neatly makes up for the Koopas' complete lack of rhythm. They're painfully goofy and cute. Interesting mechanics combined in a fun way. Funky t your fancy tech demo and cute storyline. Very well done. I like the Koopa hops a lot. All right. This tube, this tube, it goes on and on and on. Let's see. Mm. I think I'll save this one for next time. If I duck, I disappear. What's with that? Hey, I think I'll save this one for next time because it's not a short one. So, I'll see you then.